I turned Hitman's Freelancer mode into a Pokemon Nuzlocke, but instead of Pokemon, this Nuzlocke uses items. The rules are simple, I am only able to acquire one item from each location in the game to add to my arsenal during my first visit to that location. Additionally, I can only get items that are in supply crates which have one use items, or if I have the credits, I am allowed to buy them from the stores that sometimes appear on levels. All other game mechanics are available to exploit, and if you'd like to see something similar in the future with slightly different rules, let me know. Welcome to the Hitman Nuzlocke Challenge. To start out with, like I explained in the intro, uh, we get our first encounter. Uh, this is our encounter for the ICA safe house. So from here on out, before levels, this crate will always spawn with three items in it, but we will only get to choose uh, this one item at the beginning of the game. And now all of these are pretty much consumables. I'm going to go with the modern lethal syringe though because that way we can get uh, some easy credits at the start from um, going down the pharmacy route or the pharmacy uh, bad guys, big pharma, because they get bonuses for poison kills. So Dubai, Mendoza and Whittleson Creek. Yeah, the only one I'm worried about is Mendoza, but it shouldn't be too difficult. I was saying I was thinking I was thinking about going for Dubai uh, because nobody's found and only use one disguise are both easily attained um, with just your fist and maybe one item that we get on that level. Uh, it's probably going to be a consumable though, but there's two targets in Mendoza. There's also two targets. There's also two targets and uh, we don't really get a good payout. So yeah, I think that we are going to have to go with Dubai just because this is the only one that makes sense for us right now. And we'll just see like how difficult the targets are uh, to to um, murder. Okay, well, we can't get either of these, so I guess I'll grab Time Tide and Seek for our like extra objective. But I do not expect to get uh, Time Tide and Seek, bon voyage, especially in Dubai. Welcome to the sector, Dubai. Intel tells us that there are syndicate members in the area. I trust that you can find them and eliminate them. Be careful, 47. And most of all, good luck. All right, where are our syndicate members? So one is upstairs in, like, a fancy office area. Uh, and the other one is one of the guards um, upstairs. The guard upstairs should... Or is he upstairs? He is definitely upstairs. The guard upstairs should be alone. So I think it will be pretty easy to... Um, actually take him out just gonna uh, get upstairs by using the elevator see on no he's one level up not seeing any boxes which is uh, unfortunate oh this <laughs> this sucks we have a guard right here who does actually seem to be pointed away so we just have to wait for everyone else to move away I think that guard will see me if I pop up right now but I'm not I'm not positive and I don't want to risk it because that would be a really easy way to die also we're definitely going to lose um, time tide and seek uh, that's just like hard to get this early on all right so we were able to move out from the elevator shaft and we i see a box as well which might help us with our Hello. getting our targets on this level i'm just gonna go just for it i'm just gonna send it That's right, 900 hours. Yeah. okay that's one target down Excellent work, 47. You've spread fear within the syndicate. oh that is not the room i thought it was but we might, if we get into here, I think that there's a thing to hide in. <laughs> nice. So we did keep uh, time, time, and seek. And I'll just take this guy down just to, like, make it easier to move around the area. I want to grab that other guard, too, just so that people don't get alerted. And just I'll just stick him in this room, because I don't think anyone else really uses this room. Uh, which should be easy i don't think anyone's going to be here to uh see me um you know just dragging uh dragon corpses around <laughs> okay cool now what do we have in here 
the explosive baseball is a very good item. Um, it's basically just like a glass grenade. Um, so I will take that. I'm going to reset my timer. All right, so now for this last guy, what I'm thinking is because this baseball is consumable and I don't think it will come back to the safe house with me, I will just toss the baseball like into the room and then hopefully they're all drawn to that sound. Or, I th yeah, I think I'm going to have to do that. I don't think I've ever been in any of these rooms before. Oh. Don't have the baseball out. Okay, this thing... Okay, we can we can blow it up through the uh, bamboo. Syndicate member eliminated. Well done, 47. You should get back to the safe house. I'll contact you later. Okay, now we just need to not get spotted on our way out. Or actually... Uh, we really need... Okay, we can, we're just gonna go for it. Nice. Wow, we got a... We probably got a huge payout from that mission. 4,200 for our first mission is great. That means that we can probably just, like, buy a pistol from a supplier on one of the next levels, um, which would be amazing. Uh, pistols in this game, in my opinion, are the best weapon. Um, we're probably not going to be able to get anything anything silenced, but still being able to, like, snipe people from across the map with uh, with a handgun is amazing. Impressive work, 47. Let me know when you're ready for your next assignment. Yes, I do think it was impressive. And we didn't even use our um, our poison, so we still have our poison, although neither of these... Well, this one requires me to poison a guard um, for a thousand, but it just it doesn't have an elimination payout at all. It has zero elimination payout, so if I'm not able to do that or do my um, like special objective, I get no money. This, for the Whittleton Creek, I at least get 200, but I know Whittleton Creek a lot better than Mendoza. Um, so I'd rather do the final level on Whittleton Creek. There's just, it, it's just so easier, so much easier not to die in Whittleton Creek. Um, cause in Mendoza, they'll often put the targets in the, um, big party area. Uh, and it's really hard to get away from that. Anyways, I think I'm going to do Mendoza and we'll try to poison our guard for a special objective. Do we get Silent Assassin? Oh no, but we can get time to get disguises, I guess. For 3,500, that will that will be a huge payout if we can uh, save this to Whittleton Creek and then buy something uh, buy something in Whittleton Creek. That would probably be best. One of my least favorite things about Freelancer is how it spawns you in like the middle of uh, Guard City on every level. I hear guards talking out there above me, um, but I should probably try to get this one's disguise. Not exactly sure on his path team, but I'm pretty sure he comes down here. Or, yeah, there he goes. I wish I had something to throw. Melee thrown weapons are also really good for this challenge. Will he... Will the guard above see me? I don't think so. Alright. Well, we'll pacify him, and then we'll pacify the guard above so that this guy doesn't get seen. Alright, well now we have uh, a guard uniform, so we can move around this part of the level way, way more easier. I'll just, yeah, I definitely need to pacify this guy as well. I'm not sure if guards come down here. I just have not spent um, enough time on this level in this area. So just to be safe... <laughs> I'm gonna drag this guy down the stairs. Cool. All right. So these two are down, giving um, th that makes this like a very appealing escape from the mansion. All right. Now where's our targets? Uh, is that in the like big dance area? Might also be in like the vineyard, but I don't think freelancer really puts targets there very often. They're really low, though. I'm not sure where they are. Yeah, they're definitely... Or maybe they are. I guess they're... Yeah, they're in here. 
Julio. All right, we're probably not going to be able to make get disguises. Uh, just because it's really hard to do that in here. All right, I'm thinking we lethal syringe this guy. Or push him. Okay. <laughs> that that is one way to get rid of a target, I guess. Uh, you know, just just push them in there. Oh, we also still need to poison a guard. I don't want to poison this guard. He's too in sight. Maybe yeah, we're gonna lose time. Get disguises. It's fine. Maybe I poison a guard on the way out during this during the escape. I have also never been to this area of this level before. Right. We're just gonna punch these two. Well done, forty-seven. This will surely be a blow to the syndicate. Return to the safe house. All right. Collect yourself. I'll be in touch. I am going to try to poison a guard on my way out, though, because I do really want that 1,000. So let's just get the lethal syringe ready. We need to find our basically third uh, required target on this stage. Where is someone... Where's a guard that's isolated? I am so surprised I was able to... Uh, kill one of them like in front of everyone right there all right i think we're gonna go with this guy oh hello sir right yeah now. i will i will don't worry about it who who noticed who noticed my crime <laughs> It said compromised. I. Okay. I think a random person just saw me. Uh. Uh. So we're just gonna escape through the vineyard. It should be fine. And that is how you get 1200 uh, Mun Muns. I think they're called like Mercedes or something in Mendoza. Okay, so with those first two down, I have 5,500 Mun Muns, which should be enough to buy something like pretty good from a supplier. We currently do not have any items though. Um, and I think I, yeah, I missed my Mendoza um, encounter, so I just don't get an item from Mendoza. Um, but we're onto Whittleton Creek, which does have a supplier. So uh, I'm going to try to get to the supplier. Um, Hopefully buy a You've done well, John. We now we'll see though. Information on the syndicate. Okay, we can't do like it's not possible to do either of uh either, either of the first two. So we're gonna go with eliminate leader. Okay, smoker, bookworm, glasses, hat, tattoo, black hair. Welcome to Whittleton Creek. This is the last stand. We now know the leader's location. However. You will need to do some recon to make sure you get the right target. Nevertheless, we do know this. They are here for an exchange. We also know that they have black hair. They are sporting a tattoo. They are wearing glasses and wearing a hat. We also know that the target is a smoker. And they like to read, be it keeping up with the times or simply wanting to be inspired. I hope this will help. Be careful, 47. And most of all, good luck. Alrighty, um, so the supplier's in the basement of this house, which, uh, I don't remember if you need anything special for this house. You do. Uh, I wish I could pick up the key, but I can't. <laughs> um, so we're gonna have to get creative with how we get inside. And by creative, I mean, I'm gonna ring the doorbell like a normal person. Okay, it's this house, the house with the handyman. So I think he's alone um, in this house. Pretty sure. Uh, and 
Oh, wait, there is someone around. Uh, we'll wait for this person to leave, hopefully, and those walkers not to be here. And, you know, we'll just, uh, just invite ourselves in. Hi. Hello. <clears throat> yeah, no. Enough of this. Thanks for letting me in, uh, my guy. Very helpful. And I'll just, uh, I'll just subdue you right now so I don't have to... I'm not gonna kill you, my guy. You don't, don't have to freak out. I'm just gonna put you in a bathtub. Uh, that's not full of acid. You should be able to do that, in my opinion. Like, um... Put people in bathrooms <laughs> you know it's like a hiding location no one else can see them when they rock walk into the room where they're like oh they're just asleep you know you want to buy something i got it all yeah um thank you don't know why you set up shop in a random house's basement but okay Ooh, a seeker one this this is s tier <laughs> this is great um I think I I think we have to go with this. This is like the the okay. So the other options, if we didn't go with this, would be um, the machete, the wrench, the lockpick, the uh, remote control explosive, or the assault rifle. We're not going to go with the assault rifle because that would be stupid. Uh, the explosive ducks one use. The lockpick is really good, um, and like we wouldn't have to ring doorbells to get into houses. The wrench and the machete are like the same-ish. Um, I like the machete a lot too, just because like insta kills that I don't have to worry about, but wrench is better for not losing all of my money. But this this seeker uh, poisons people, um, which would have been really good to have for this syndicate uh, <laughs> before I started, but uh, it poisons people and then they go throw up in a bathroom. Come back if it's you very, very more. good. Why is there an assassin nearby? Where is this assassin? Okay. Now, on to find our targets. Yeah, and it should make this, like, this level super easy once we uh, find our target, because we'll just be able to isolate them. All right. Oh, you... I don't think earrings was one of the things was it yeah glasses hat black hair do you have a tattoo oh wait you do you do have a tattoo right on your leg i'm glad someone found it weird that i was just walking around uh filming this lady without our permission Okay, so she could very possibly be a target. And then we have... Oh, they're doing the handoff right now. So it's probably her. I don't see a tattoo on this other lady that just came. Yes, she also has a tattoo. Okay, I think it's one of these two. But I don't know which one. And they're... Hey, Wait, can we close here. this garage? Let's get down to business. The package, please. What's I your take it. on these Wilson Be people, careful Penelope? With you, okay? They seem very nice. How is it on your end? Exactly. Perfect. Perfect teeth, perfect clothes, perfect house, perfect gifts. Okay, but you're I... right. I had this sneaking suspicion when they first came here. The Chardonnay was a little too crisp. Have... The hors d'oeuvres, well, like tiny... Missed that chance. ...pieces of art. They're hiding. Something hmm. Okay. Uh just won't leave his place at the barbecue. The gas is missing. What's up with that? Not to mention you've been in her extremely vague answers. I asked what she did for a living. You know what she said? Oh, I work for the government. Boring stuff. Oh, this one's also smoking. So it's it's probably this lady actually. Nobody on a government Now that I think about it. Live in Whittleton Creek. Want to go look for All right. Things. Can I seek her this person from the Oh god, the lookout, the lookout, oh no. We're all good. 
All right, I am almost positive that this is our target. So we just need to isolate this lady now, um, which should be easy if I can get us if I can get the seeker shot. Where is she gonna go? Oh, also, is her guard coming with her? Oh no. Please go somewhere else, my dude. Okay, he's he's leaving. All right, she's isolated in the bathroom. This is our chance. Congratulations, All right, and now we leave. <laughs> yeah, that was clean. That was clean. A seeker definitely helped out a lot there. I don't think she was ever going to uh, be isolated um, without using the seeker. So this way we don't have to like fight anyone. Excuse me, sir. Are you original? And we got. 3,500, maybe, maybe more from this one. So we can probably buy something from a supplier again. I might want to wait a few rounds to buy something from a supplier again, just to like get a bit more money so that we can afford something more expensive. Um, but with the seeker, we're we're in a really good spot. Well done, this... All right, so we get our. Uh, what our special thing because we completed the syndicate which i am letting myself take because i just think it makes it more interesting and gives us more permanent items and we get the tac smg um probably not gonna use this unless like i think i'm heading into a shootout for a level but i will put it down here so for our next campaign we have the seeker and the pack smg so we either want to do a big pharma campaign or a um uh arms trafficking so for arms tra trafficking we would be on the ambrose island in bangkok miami and whittleton creek we all there we already have our encounter for whittleton creek okay both of these have whittleton creek um but uh for uh this one we get Colorado, which is a terrible level in uh, Freelancer if I can't pick up guns. Um, but we also have Hokkaido, which is uh, my best level in Hitman by far. Because of the fist only challenge on it. Alright, I'm also thinking of doing uh, an espionage syndicate type. Because this works really well for not having any items. And it has Whittleton Creek again for an option. Um, but the other ones are Bangkok, uh, China, and Hokkaido, which I'm good at. Um, I'm good at the bottom three, less so with China. But um, Bangkok is really just not my level. All right, I think we'll do this one. All right, so we're not going to go to China because we don't want to lose. But we will probably go with Hokkaido. So poison target with a dart gun. Uh, that's an easy 1500. Do not pacify. An easy 1000. And push kill. Um, if we can get, if we can poison them in a section where they are near a cliff, I guess so. But that's going to be a lot harder to do. Um, but hopefully we can get like silent assassin or time trial is fine i guess all right so we're gonna go into this with the seeker safe journey 47. yeah so if if everything went perfectly to plan we'd poison them when they're near a cliff because they'll go to the cliff to throw up off of it and then we'd push them off um in like two minutes and 30 seconds or however long the time trial is but we're probably not going to get um all of the uh achievements we also want to get our item for this level um if we can well 
You know the drill. We have a minute and 50 seconds. We're not going to get the time trial, I guess. All right. Uh, did we just have... Yeah, we just have one target. Oh, and it's the... It's the head doctor? All right. Um, this is not the best place. Let's see. Does anyone see me? Oh, wait. Did they see... They... Did they see me? No. No, 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 no. Okay, hopefully the guards will just stay down there. And not alert everyone. Um. Wait, how did they know it was me? What the heck? Alright, hopefully they just stay down there with Yuki. And don't... And don't pay attention. No, he locked the door behind him. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. I need someone to come and unlock this door. Oh no, this would have been really good, but it's not. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Alright, it seems that they're not looking for me anymore, and only one of the guards knows what I look like. I don't know why. I have no clue why, but I mean, I'm cool with that. Hey, want to walk near this door so it unlocks? Alright, so I don't... I don't know how long he's gonna be in there for. But he has to leave eventually, right? <laughs> Alright, we failed the time trial because our target is locked in a bathroom. Good to see you. Good to see you too, sir. Alright, how are we... <laughs> How are we going to get to this guy? Alright, he's he's done throwing up. So now he will open the door. Hey, stop. Well done, 47. This will surely be a blow to the syndicate. You should get back to the safe house. I'll contact you later. We're gonna take his disguise just so that we can like um, move through the, uh, back areas of, uh, this level and get to the escape over there. Alright, that was really messy. Um, I think what would have gone better if, uh, what could have gone better is if I didn't get seen, um, when I was shooting the doctor. And also, also if I was just closer behind him. Uh, when I followed him into, the, uh, like when I was following him to the room, because that would have saved us a, that would have saved us a lot of trouble. My ears. Good work back there. The syndicate took a serious blow, but there is still much work to get done. So did my confidence. <laughs> All right, for our next, we only made eighteen hundred that level, but we have a sizable sum of seventy-three hundred. Oh, and we missed our encounter on Hokkaido, but that's fine. Alright, we could go to Whittleton Creek and just make some money there. Do not change the skies. Take no damage, no firearms. I don't know if the Seeker counts as a firearm or not. Um, so I'll try not to use it, but I like all of these, and I like Whittleton Creek. A silent Assassin suit only? Say no more. We'll take that. All right, so this is like a lot of, um, a lot of restrictions. Wasn't one of my other restrictions do not change disguise? That, um, that combos really well with silent assassin suit only. Um, but yeah, a lot of difficult restrictions for this one. But on Whittleton Creek, it should be pretty easy, especially if the seeker does not count as a firearm, uh, and we'll be able to make bank on this level. To the north and take them down. Be careful, 47. And most of all, good luck. Alright, so we have one over there, and we have one uh, near these construction workers. So I'm going to start with trying to figure out how to get rid of this guy. Should be pretty easy. Um, if we seeker him, we'll, he'll go over to the river, and then we can definitely like uh, push him in and drown him, I think. I think that works. Um, 
issue is I think it's a these journal, three. Or a, or a diary. Where is he going? Hmm. Okay, I can't just push him in. But if we're in the bushes, and this guy wasn't here, easy dub. Easy dub. All right, hear me out. We're going to seek her. We're going to seek her, that guy. Oh, I don't think this is good at all. And then as he turns away... Where are you? My dude, go anywhere else but over to my target. Jeez. <laughs> okay, we take him out while he... Uh, passes through these bushes right here. All right. Drag him in to these bushes. Oh, that did count as a firearm. All right, his body's hidden. Coolio. That was pretty clean. Um, but now we know Seeker counts as a firearm, technically. <sighs> yeah, that was clean, though. That was clean. Is this target in the one Russian guy's house? Or this house? Is he like a guard on the back porch? Because that's going to be annoying to get to. Because there's cameras everywhere. Uh, and it's just really hard to deal with these backyards. But once we're inside, it should be pretty easy. Also, nice thing with Seeker. We can always just like Seeker, uh, the guard on the front, at the front door. He'll go inside, and then we have a way in if we're really close behind him. But there's a camera, so don't really like that idea. All right, this backyard is a good way to get into this house, but it's also scary. Because um, uh, gardeners with guns, let me tell you, they are they are some scary people. Very American, you know? Um. Oh, is he like... The old man's private guard? Or, oh, are they going outside? Please go away. Please go away. Please go away. Stop looking at the corner of the house. Okay. How are we going to get inside of... I was, <laughs> was going to say, how are we going to get inside of you? But um, that's, that is not, <laughs> that is not what uh, I was intending. <laughs> um, how are we going to get inside of this house? Sir. Oh, sorry, sorry. That's yep. One foot in front of the other. Totally forgot that Silent Assassin um, gets uh, you lose Silent Assassin if you trespass. Like I knew that, but I didn't realize that that walking onto someone's porch was trespassing, which it is. But you know, how in the world am I going to get into this house? <laughs> we could try. Um, we could try approaching it from the back side or from this right side if this guard this guard moves though um because i don't think there's guards in this in this backyard i just wait for him to be gone and just just you know don't have to do oh wait there are guards in this in this yard or maybe they're not guards but construction workers could seeker shot this guy, but I don't want to waste it on just, you know, some random guy. We'll still get a nice, like, 1800 payout from this level if we get the rest of our uh, thingamabobbles. But would have been nice to get, you know, 4,000 more. <laughs> I swear, half of Hitman is just sitting and waiting for people to move. <laughs> uh, which, I mean... It's probably what real life hitman is is like you know just 
waiting for people to move so that they can be silently taken care of. I don't think this guy ever ever leaves this area. Hey, this is a predicament. Um, I thought I might be able to pull this guy down. Does not look like it. I can maybe get behind them. Hey, I say, let the old man smoke. Have you seen that oxygen tank near his bedroom window? When you can't breathe with the help of your own lungs, it's probably not wise to also breathe through a cigarette. Letting him smoke is basically euthanasia. Oh no. Oh no, what have I done? Okay, just gonna... Just gonna do a good old... Uh... That was... Not the uh, cleanest, but... Oh no. Alright, we're gonna... Still, this guy's clothes and hide in the bushes. The guy's trying to pass someone else. He's not here. Oh no. Oh my god. This has just progressively gotten worse and worse. I don't know how I'm going to get out of this one. All right, I think we have to escape that way. Yeah, well, they're going over there. Just run. Yeah, that was stupid. Anyone around? No, I want your outfit. Well, fuck. <laughs> you know what's worse than, um... Oh, wait. Oh, nice, 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 nice. All right. Is there a person right there? Okay. We took care of these two. Um, my heart is pumping very fast. Took care of these two. Uh, we're literally not going to make any money from this mission. But at least now uh, we can maybe possibly move inside this building. I think this door is locked. But there's a doorbell. And, uh, this guy just opened this door because of the gun, I guess, which is nice. Oh, our target comes to the front door. Hello, mister. Hello. It's not you I want, sir. Sorry, keep walking. Keep walking. Yep, keep walking. All right, nice, nice, nice. All right, we're inside the house. Good, good. All right, now we just have to find a time when this guy's alone and isolated. Then we can just, you know, do a quick uh, squeeze, squeeze, snap, crack a lacka. There, there are a large amount of guards here that do know that I'm not supposed to be here, unfortunately. People like you. Oh, they. Die. They found my pile. Altruistic. Oh, well, I don't know about all that. I just feel like giving something back to the community that has given me so much. Speaking of which, when are you coming Is over? he wearing a bathrobe? Ah, excellent. I'm still a little sore, but maybe later, if my muscles stop cramping so much. I would love that. Me too. <clears throat> anyway, I will let you get on with your baking. I will call you again later. All right, darling. 
All right, Six. nice. But did you see my photograph? The group photo from the first gathering. Uh, I'm gonna be no, moving. Well, it must be and oh, and oh, a snipe in the butt. The right now. It's gonna head to the bath. Which bathroom is he heading to? Set into this bathroom and uh, I'm going to see if he needs any help. You know, getting everything out of his system. Uh, I think you, uh, I think it's better if you just wash that out with water. You know, um. Excellent work, 47. You've spread fear within the syndicate. You should get back to the safe house. I'll contact you later. Okay, much less clean than the last time we were in Whittleton, but we at least make 850. Isn't nothing. Alright, this syndicate has been so messy so far. But now we are on our way to either Bangkok or China. And China sounds uh this China level just looks miserable. Because we have three targets. We have three targets. Um, yeah, it just does not seem like fun. But Bangkok has one, only use one disguise, poison target, which we can do. Fiber wire kill, we can't do, we don't have fiber wire. But that is an easy 2800. So I think we'll go with that. Uh, and then I guess I'll just pick up time trial and we'll see if it happens. Pro I'm not whole thinking it will. Um, Safe journey, and then I think this level had a supplier too, so we can maybe buy something. Good luck, forty-seven. Oh no, they're on like the top four of of Cross's penthouse. This is going to be uh, miserable. I'm not. I am not getting the uh, time trial I was hoping for. Uh, the suppliers is on that sort of the building though, which is nice. Uh, we're probably gonna want to grab a guard disguise. We can use one disguise, so that will be worth it. Don't have to worry about Silent Assassin or anything, so it should be pretty easy to grab from one of the cards up here. Um, I'll probably just poison them and then follow them to where they go and uh, pacify them while they are alone. One of these two. I've always thought that lady was weird. All right. So, we're going to... After I put my camera away, we are going to... Sh that was really close. Um, wow, talk about horrible timing. That was... That was almost really, really bad. Uh, we're Okay, no one else is going to come through either of these doors? Good. All right, we're going to pull out the Seeker. Hit him in the back. We're going to follow him to wherever he goes. Which is going to be... Where are you going to go, buddy? Where are you going to go? Okay, it's I'm probably going to be trespassing if I follow him in here, but... Who cares, really? You know, I'm just helping a, a poor guy out. I mean, look at him. He's really struggling. Thank you for the outfit. Alright, we lost time trial. Um, did not think we were going to get it. Oh, that was... What is it with the timing on this stage? This is super scary. Alright. Alright, we just have to make our way across the roof top to the supplier who is upstairs. Easy to do. Will they get mad at me if I vault this? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> They're just, you know, hanging out. Bros being bros. No, no, no. They hit me. They had me. They're not going to let me. Security detail here. Oh! Sorry, buddy. Security Wait. Was just not oh. Stopped. You know how it is. You know, one guy gave me a positive response. I thought I was going to be let through. The other guy doesn't. But my fist only knowledge is coming through. Wait. Yeah, my fist only knowledge is coming through. And I can just. 
take this guy down. Oh, they can only use one. What was that sound? I can only use one disguise. Uh, sacrificing the thousands worth it. Yeah, I know, game. What have I done? What have I done? What was... What was that noise? All right, we've made it to the upper floor, and we're already being almost spotted by people. Just kidding. Really stuff soul. This area is full of people who don't, uh, do know that I'm not who I say I am. All right, my guy, what do you have for me? Yeah, I do want to buy something. All right, all right. Is that right? Okay, hear me out. <laughs> the the best item on here for us currently is this or this. The crowbar lets us unlock doors and it unlocks like several exits. Like on Whittleton Creek, you can exit through the sewer grate, I think, with the crowbar. Um, but we can also throw it as a passive vacation melee weapon and we can knock people out with it it's really good like s tier uh the seeger is a sniper rifle that's silenced um but we would have to carry it around in a suitcase which we can throw at people um so suitcase is like a tier in my opinion but uh we can't like wear it on our backs even as guards so you know unwieldy so even this, even though a silent sniper rifle would be fun, I think that the crowbar is the correct choice. Alright, now, how are we going to take out this lady? Because she likes to hang out in, like, the middle of everything. So we're definitely going to have to seek her, seek her, her. But how... That is the question. That is the question. We're still um, still using our guard uniform. It would be pretty easy. Oh, wait. This might be the shot. Oh, wait. Oh. That was, that was a close one, let me tell you. Why are there people everywhere? There's people just everywhere. I can't, I can't take the shot. Because someone will see me. Okay, cool, man. All right, we got it, boys. We got it. We took the shot. We made it happen. All right, where is she going though? Hopefully, there's a bathroom up here. I I know that there's like hotel room or yeah, back rooms up here. So she might be heading for one of those. Just hopefully not like throwing up in the gardens or something okay yeah we are going for one of these no <laughs> you don't this is not this is not an appropriate place to to do this ma'am um i mean if you're gonna do it you just you just have to go all all in um yeah all right hope you're hope you're feeling better now well done Will surely be a blow to the syndicate. Return to the safe house. Collect yourself. And now we make a daring escape. Okay, that was pretty clean. Um having to use multiple disguises was not the best, but it could have been way worse. Okay, this next assignment is going to suck we're going to china uh and we have six potential targets uh and it is very likely that we're going to lose so we're definitely going to want to go to the supplier uh right at the start 
We can't get any of these. I'm not going to even bother taking I've provided one. You with new intel. Okay. <clears throat> so this level is going to be extremely difficult. I'm going to go in with the Seeker and the... Um, uh, the Seeker and the Crowbar. But that still might not be enough to get us through this level. It's going to be very, very difficult. We do not know the exact identity of the target, so you'll have to do some recon. Oh, However, they are spread they're out. High alert, so you need to be careful. To help you, we have the following information. They are here to attend a business meeting. As for their identity, we know that they have red hair. They are wearing a hat. They are wearing a necklace. And has a tattoo. We have further intel that informs us that the target suffers from dehydration. And they smoke. Use these traits to your advantage. Be careful, 47. Red hair, hat, necklace, and tattoo. So I'm just gonna go through like these early, uh, these early rain, ones. Rain, Imagine if it was this person. Uh, I can't even tell what their hair color is. I think it's brown though. Yeah. So, hey. you are uh, not the suspect. Who is this? Red hair, hat, tattoo, tattoo, necklace. Don't think they have a necklace, but they might. I'm just gonna leave them undecided. All right. Who's next on the list? Got some people down a level. Oh wait, I think that they might I think that they might be underground. Possibly. Which would suck because I don't think there is a um open area. Oh, which means that we have to like storm a building and that's going to be miserable and hard to do but you gotta do what you gotta do okay we also have some more targets like in this building they are so spread out on this level yeah what i don't want to happen is like i um i start railroading like one or two uh like it in, in that underground area and be willing to knock out guards and then the alarm gets raised and then Next thing you know, everyone's escaping. Yeah, could be, could just turn out really bad. Also, I think the supplier's in here, so worthwhile going here anyways. There's two guys around this corner. Pretty easy to take care of, especially with a crowbar. Oh no! They got alerted. Oh, what? Not, not the gun. <laughs> okay, this is really bad. This is really, really bad. This is really bad. Right, we just we're gonna just have to go for hope that this guy is our target and go for him he could literally just not have red hair but we we have to try 47 your target is on to you and is trying to get away okay it's not this guy it's one of the other three this is bad this is really bad Okay, we're probably gonna lose. We're probably gonna lose. Gotta get down the stairs faster. 47. <laughs> Run. <laughs> Alright, we're not. There's no way we make it. Like, unless it's... Unless it's one of these people. Okay, it might be this lady. It might be this lady.
No. No. <laughs> we almost had it, boys. We almost had it. How unfortunate. It rather appears that you ran out of luck. Back to the drawing board, 47. Yeah, it was bad. That was stupid. That last gym was really hard. I wasn't playing around the crits, you know? But with all of the work I put in, I couldn't help but feel a sense of accomplishment. As I pulled my battered and broken body down my hall full of motivational posters that reminded me of the good times. And as I entered the briefing room, all I could feel was pride and the pain from the bullet holes I had reopened while walking down the hallway. I hope you enjoyed, and if you did, you might enjoy my other Hitman videos. Thank you.